Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with a one box personal break for Hunter Watson who picked up a box of 2019 Topps Gypsy Queen Baseball. There it is, two on-card autographs per box. Good luck. And that second half of NT is already down to five. Nice. Let's finish that off. Oh, we got an X-Men marathon happening on FX. X-Men Apocalypse? I don't remember X-Men Apocalypse. I don't remember that one. Am I lucky? I never saw it. All right, we just watched uh, on FX was it was Days of Future Past or whatever it was called. I think that one was pretty good. I remember seeing that one. Apocalypse, I do not remember. What's this one about? There's really not that much. There's no no real sports going on tonight. The MLB Network's playing Bull Durham. I've seen that. I love that movie, but I've seen it a million times. And I don't like it on I don't like the edited TV version. So I opted for this movie. There are two different endings for Days of Futures Past. That makes it kind of confusing. Like they should stop. They feel like they should uh, stop making X Men movie for for a little while. Let let the ones we have just marinate a little bit for a little while. All right. Oh, there you go. Gypsy Queen autograph. Uh, Tops Gypsy Queen logo swap parallel. Yusai Kikuchi. Good start already. Yeah, Bull Durham is fantastic. Great baseball movie. Very quotable. At a two fifty. I don't even know. This is a personal box. I don't need to mark this. Well, which new one? I, I think Dark Phoenix looks terrible, if that's what you're talking about. I, I don't know if that one looked good. But I think, aren't they making a new X-Men movie, though? With the whole crew? The whole, the usuals? I feel like that next one could be pretty cool. You want a remake of Ghost Rider, says Vince. Yeah, that, that original with, what, Nicolas Cage, I think, looked awful. I never got into Ghost Rider. That... Seemed a little, not, not that, not that X Men isn't silly, but the Ghost Rider premise just seemed even sillier. I'm just gonna take that seriously. Oh, the new X Men, yeah, okay. The new X Men, X Men looks pretty good. Dark Phoenix, I don't know, that one doesn't look good. That looks like a, uh... and there's Jake Bowers, Ray's edition here. 
That one looks like a like a made for TV movie, like a CW show. Oh, <laughs> for a second there, it looked like he got shot. It looked like a movie. It's like, pfft, ow! Uh, Hellboy, I didn't, get, I didn't get into either. Nice black and white. Tyler Glass now. Now, Hunter, I would also, if you go to CardboardConnection.com and look up Gypsy Queen, they'll give you, um, I think they'll give you the parallel, if you like look at the little codes on the bottom, the number codes on the bottom, they'll give you the variation guide. I would double check those too, uh, to make sure we didn't miss any variations. It's hard to kind of tell just at a glance, but. And that's 19 out of 50. Is this an X Men movie? Why are they Why are they in ancient Egypt? It's the blank front variation. I don't know what's going on here. And there's Kenley Jansen at the end. Pretty solid break, Hunter. Let's see what we got in here. What we got? Reese Hoskins. Is this Ross Al Ghul? There's a uh, Aaron Nola. Sometimes these can be autographed. We haven't seen one yet. This is very confusing. And this is numbered right here, Josh Hader. Out of 150, 87 out of 150. Nice break for you, Hunter. I think this overall is pretty solid. You got Yusai Kikuchi, which is one of the one of the big rookies for the Mariners this year. Right. And some nice parallels and variations as well. All right, Hunter, thank you very much. We'll see you next time. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.